boom boom just kidding everybody <laughs> welcome back to the channel all right got a little bit of mobile legends adventures up uh, we do have a collab up we'll talk a little bit about that and the unfortunate surrounding uh unfortunate circumstances surrounding the collab uh as well so let's go ahead and jump right into it so as you can see we've got a collab with it is wrong to pick up the girls in a dungeon it's a collab with uh, don machi it's a very popular anime uh, I think it's running into its fourth season now. It will be coming out here sometime, probably in the summer. But uh, there's some bad things about the collab. First of all, is the fact that you will get the you will get Mel for free, uh, and I assume on the um, uh, actual set which uh, Eyes comes out, just Sword Princess will be on the 14th. I assume you get a free copy of her as well. Okay, unfortunately. There just really isn't uh, anything that you can actually do to get the character um, other than through the event and through, they'll give you the free copy. You'll be able to get a copy of the character uh, through the event tab right here. Uh, you're doing the mini daily quests. You get, get a copy of him here. All right, you'll get a copy of him inside of the actual event which is the actual uh, levels inside of the actual um, not the realm of legends the actual tinted barrage guess from Wario uh, you'll get copies of him at 715 You'll get copies of him at 10.15, and you'll get a copy of him at 11.15. These are emblem cards. Okay. Uh, so an emblem is designated owner. A duplicate five-star bell will convert to the side of what you already own bell. Okay, it can be used to fuse bell once you have bell awakened. Under, but, uh, so you can get copies of him right here. Okay, uh, unfortunately, uh, one of the primary ways of getting these characters, if you want to get these characters, is done through the Wishing Shrine. But unfortunately, during the event, you can only summon the collab exclusive heroes via the collab limited time summon with shiny crystals instead of five star hero fricks. After the event ends, the exclusive heroes will not be obtainable from premium summon, miracle summon, prophecy summon, sacred oath, or friendship summon, nor can they be obtained using five star hero fragments. What does that mean? It means it's a pay character. Okay, the reason it's a pay character is simply because of the fact that the only way to get shiny crystals is right here in the core pass, which costs twenty nine ninety nine. Okay, so basically it's a pay character. Uh, once this event ends, you will not be able to get any more copies of this character. I assume you'll only be able to get more copies of this character whenever uh, another collab with Amachi gets rolls around. Don't know how long that will be, but. And from a free-to-play perspective, you're going to get maybe two or three star, red two or three uh, on the characters all you're going to be able to get uh, from this event. Probably the same with Eyes when she pops up here uh, in a week. So these are pay characters. Uh, there's no other way to put it. Okay? You're not going to be able to get any copies of them only during this event. Uh, and the only way to get enough copies to make the character usable is if you pay for it. So put it bluntly, pay character. Irrelevant. Don't care. Not happy about it, but it's not earth shattering simply because of the fact that I don't need a martial character or an elemental character. I've already got those two teams fairly maxed out. Okay, so this would he's not going to make a difference to me in terms of that. I've got the character, I'll get the character when it been ends, I'll just forget about him, and then when it comes back up again, I'll maybe get a few more copies of him, and <laughs> so what, so what. But it's going to be years before he's usable, so. I'm not going to worry about it. Uh, but just get a copy, log on, get your free copy of them so you'll have a copy of them if you want. Okay? Um, you can't really, you know, you can't use, you can't gauge the character from the event because he's a hot character. So I think he's like considered max in the event. Uh, so that's, so when you're using him for that, you know, so you can't really get, I don't know. He's an elemental marshal. We've already got an elemental marshal. Uh, we've got an elemental marshal. Uh, it's Nimbus Dora. Uh, a fan favorite. I've got her maxed out. She's a martial elemental. Only difference between the two is that she is a backline or a midline backline 
um, arcanist, which is basically a mage. Uh, Bell is a fighter, frontline. Okay, so that's the only difference between the two uh, in terms of that. But they're both elemental marshals. Okay, is he is he is Bell a good guy? I don't know. I'm never going to be able to get him kind of to be actually be usable. Um, you can talk to see, you watch some videos on the subject. My assumption would be since he's a collab character, the collab characters are usually pretty good. Okay, but yeah, you know, it is what it is. We we'll have to see. But it looks like you're only going to be able to get him to three, two, uh, two red, maybe three red. I don't know. I'm going to get all copies of him that I can for free to play, and we'll see what I get at the end of it. <laughs> okay, uh, I should be able to get up to eleven fifteen, uh, fourteen fifteen. Uh, I've gotten there once, so I should be able to get there again. Um, and, and from then, I'll be able to tell whether or not uh, he's something that's worth considering. But yeah, two or three is the only, only thing you're going to be able to get from a free-to-play perspective because we're completely locked out of this. Okay, and this is where, as you can see, uh, one copies, two copies, three copies, four copies, five copies, six copies, seven copies, eight copies, nine copies, there's nine copies right here. This is completely shut out for us, and it's going to be completely shut out for us to our eyes as well, because it's going to be these shiny crystals as well. Um, and he's not going to be in the premium summon, not going to be in the miracle summon, not going to be in the prophecy summon, not going to be in sacred oath. Okay, so just uh, it says right here at the bottom, this scrolls across the screen. You can only summon the collab exclusive here is via the collab limited time summon. This right here. Okay. It ends there will not be obtainable for premium miracle prophecy sacred oath or friendship summit so he's not going to be uh anyway there's absolutely positively no way on earth you're going to be able to obtain any copies of this character until the collab rerun happens okay so just keep that in mind so he's not going to be usable uh for any of your uh ever okay i mean even if you're just starting out because of this collab uh it, within a couple of weeks, maybe even a couple of you know, a month, you're going to be past what this is. You'll, you'll, you're going to have characters uh, at five or six uh, or five red, four or five red, and in, inside of a few weeks, maybe a month, uh, and they'll be bypassing him because he's still going to be stuck at a two or three red. So he's not. He's just a character that you could obtain uh, once this event ends. I'll forget about him. I don't need him. Like I say, my martial and elemental teams are almost set right now, so there's I, I don't really need a new character for that. Um, but you know, otherwise you could you know. But yeah, he's not going to be usable for very long. Uh, and if you can't get any copies of him to level him up, then it's really just useless. So I'll participate in the collab just because I like the uh, like the actual anime. Uh, I'll obtain all the rewards. There's a lot of rewards in it, so it's definitely something worth paying. Uh, I'm sorry, definitely something worth playing, not paying. Never ever pay. <laughs> uh, so, yeah, I, I'm just upset that they should have had this some way that there would be easier for us to obtain him. Uh, so, take a look at uh, what else we got going on. So, we've got the uh, trial of our member. This is a copy of the way to get him. It should be easy enough to get him inside of here. Just do these each day. They reset each day. Do it. And once you get to 30, you'll get another copy of him. Uh, surprise coming. This is. Uh, a way to get uh, 10 of the actual shiny crystals okay so that's really nice once you get to 300 okay that's great unfortunately with 10 shiny crystals you just get 1,000 gems <laughs> you need to get 25 shiny crystals before you get a copy so it's really not anything just do it you know because a thousand diamonds is a thousand diamonds <laughs> so so yeah so, uh, so take you know take a in here uh these are going to be resetting as, as the same it's going to run for 13 days now they're going to refresh in five okay so um uh, you know once you get the member crust uh 2000 uh, and then of course this year to get 10 okay but yeah that's not going to help you gorgeous gift uh this is if you purchase uh some of the esekai download counter some of the skins Okay, you'll get this nice little uh, exclusive avatar border. Okay, uh, tavern blessing. You should definitely be uh, you should definitely be uh, setting this up. Okay, because this right here is a good way to get extra rewards, and this is just by logging in, logging daily to activate the solo bonies. 
uh, bonuses. Uh, as you can see, each one that each one of these items that has this little scroll on it, including the diamonds. That's right. You'll get extra rewards, and you can get up to twenty percent of that uh, if you uh, yeah twenty percent activation right here. Okay, I'm currently getting ten percent. Uh, so just log on six consecutive to activate all blessings. They're stackable, so you know. You know, you're going to be able to stack both, so definitely want to get as much as you can. Okay. Um, uh, and then, yeah, this will be coming up uh, on the 9th. I'll be able to access this right here. So keep in mind, uh, you know, today's the 7th, so today was the first day. Uh, tomorrow, we'll get another 10. Okay. That'll take this to 20. Okay. Uh, and then this one will activate up. That'll be 50%, 65%, 80 80%, 100% at the end. You'll be getting 100% bonus uh, on your solo banner rewards, okay? Um, uh, these blessings are set up for eight days, okay? One, two, three, four, five, six days to get the full 100. So you're going to have two days where you're going to be able to achieve 100% bonus or uh, blessings as it's called inside of the tavern so take advantage of this it's a good way to get extra rewards okay where you shot uh, this is the rewards for the dark crawl uh, you can get 80 of these by fighting you should be able to get close to that uh, the others are obtained via idle and then you can purchase some inside the daily bundle, but you should not have to. You should be able to get very close to 900. Uh, last time I did it, I think I did 910. So you should be able to get the max character. Uh, don't purchase Ember Ruchi. She's available in the shop. She's an excellent character, but just get her in the shop. You can get her that way for free. Oberon's attack. Uh, so between the two, uh, an aposte is a mage from distance. So actually choose what you want. If you want a ranged character, uh, you probably want to go for a boss day, of course. Oberon's a frontline tank character, so if you want to tank, you go for him. Okay, that should be the choice. Never go for her because she's in the shop. You can get her for free. Uh, if you're not being able to join in, you can just go it, it, and get one of these characters because you're not able to do that. Uh, there are several in here. Uh, I would probably go, if it was me personally, um, I would base my thinking on that. And probably go with Grok because he's an excellent tank. If you've got uh, Lydia Inch, you don't need to worry about that. Uh, then you can go with that. Don't pick her simply because of the fact that she's not a very good auto character. Um, second, I would probably go with him. Another excellent tank. Okay. So there's some good characters in here. She's not bad either if you need a mage. Okay, so there's some good characters in here. You should be able to get the 600 easily. Uh, and if you play consistently every day uh, and get your rewards on time, you should be able to get over uh, a little over nine, 900. Okay, because you can get 800. Right? You can get almost like, yeah, I think you can almost get like 880 or so just by doing the battle each day. Uh, I get 80. You can max is 80. It's the most you can get. I get 80. I got 80 in like seven or eight seconds. And then it ended because that's all of the actual, you know, rewards I can get. So, yeah. So just make sure you uh, do it daily and you'll, you'll, you'll get the rewards for it. Mirage code. Okay. Uh, Going to hit in five days. Now, there's actually a um, no, CD key. MLA Dungeon, all one word for the CD key to get you some diamonds. Again, MLA Dungeon, all one word. Uh, that's for the CD key. Other than that, there's really not a whole lot going on. So, again, uh, they paid characters just from the looks of it. But, you know, if you like the collab or if you like the anime, then it might be something interesting to run a collab. You know, you get him, get him two, three, uh, and then just forget about him. <laughs> Uh, like I say, I don't need them, so it's not that sort off my back. But uh, yeah, this is this is paid characters. Um, but I, I'm pretty sure that it says, is it wrong to pick up girls in a dungeon four? So my assumption is they've had this three times before. 
So they throw it up, obviously. Unfortunately, I think this is the first, pretty sure this is the first time I've seen it because I did not have Bell when the first one come up. Uh, and I don't have Eyes or Hestia, so I'm not sure, you know, I get... I start, I've been playing for about a year, so this it must have been more than a year ago that they had the collab, which means if they're having this collab on a yearly basis, um, it could literally take you five, six years to build the character up. Don't even know if the game's still going to be active at that time. Uh, so yeah, so this is a paid character. You have to purchase the more best if you want her. Uh, don't. Uh, there are other characters in the game that are better. Okay. Um, he... Uh, I'm assuming he's going to be a pretty decent character if you can get him maxed out. He is a dual, char dual threat character, but we've got dual threat characters uh, that are better. He's not going to supplant any of those, uh, and you can get copies for those and level them up. You can't him, so that makes a difference. Uh, you know, uh, two to three, a two to three red character is not going to compete with anything that's awakened. Uh, just the, there's no way around it. Uh, and you're not going to be able to get the copies to bring him up. And they've pretty much locked everything down, they say, inside the Wishing Shrine. Uh, this is, uh, this is, you know, they name every single way that you can get copies of character. And they say that you can't do any of them. Uh, they're, so they've completely locked the character down, which is normal. They do usually do that in a collab. Uh, you know, they're paying for the use of the characters. And they're only paying that you can utilize those characters uh, from a level is when during the event. Uh, most of them are like that. Uh, Bleach, Immortal Soul, uh, had a collab with Burn the Witch. Um, and the only time that you could get the characters was inside of the, during the collab. But the Bleach Immortal Soul made it so that you could actually get the character. And then get its weapon, her weapon, for them inside of the game they had it inside the event and they geared the event so that you could actually get it. I got the characters from, I got both of them uh, and I leveled up one to max. Uh, so they made it so that you could get the character inside of the event. They're not doing that. They're specifically making this so that the only way to get the character and get it leveled up to usefulness is by paying and a lot of money too, because you got to understand that, uh, uh, you know, you're getting into 150, 160 of these things, uh, and 350, that's a lot. That's hundreds of dollars it's going to take to actually do this. So, you know, uh, correct me if I'm wrong in the comments, but I'm pretty sure that, no, this is a completely pay event, uh, pay collab, I want to say. But, you know, it, it it's not that big a deal. I mean, the other events are fine. I mean, you got the event right here uh, for this. You'll be able to get a max character. Oberon and Apostle are top of the line characters, max characters, uh, some of the best in the game, right here, better than Bell. Okay, so um, they're right here, and you can get these <laughs> just by playing the game. So, yeah, you know, I, I don't mind them having a, a, a collab event where you have to pay to get a character. That's not fine. They give us a free copy of the character, and you'll be able to get two to three stars out of the character, uh, two to three red stars out of the character. But that's that's as far as you're going to be able to go from a free to play perspective. But don't buy into it. Uh, nice characters. Get them for the collector's uh, bone if you have that. Uh, the one that I have in Azure Lane. But yeah, you're not going to be able to make them any useful. Uh, inside of a few weeks, you know, even if you're a new player, inside of a few weeks, uh, you'll be able to overpower Bell with other characters. Uh, and since once this collapses, you won't be able to get any more copies of him. So he's not something that you can use. Uh, and it's probably going to be the same for Eyes. Uh, we'll have to see when she comes out next week. But I just want to point up that it is up. It's unfortunate that it's big, but it's there. Um, so uh, get in, log in. If you're not going to play, just log in so you can get the free bell. Uh, and then you can log back out after that. <laughs> At least you'll have the character and log in seven days from now <laughs> to make sure you get eyes. And then you can log back out. Uh, but you'll have a copy of the character. Um, but uh, yeah, yeah, you're not going to be able to get leveled up very high. Uh, not enough to make it useful. So it is what it is. When the event ends, we'll just forget about it <laughs> uh, until the collab rolls around again. All right. So thanks a lot for watching. Remember to subscribe. Once you subscribe, you'll see the bell. Click on it. You get notified each time I drop a video. Also, remember to like and share the video. As always, that helps the views.
on the actual video. This is Kendra, still coming at you from the corner, signing off.